Hello, welcome to this tutorial on statistics. We'll be looking at the quartiles of ungrouped data. So we have other videos on these quartiles of ungrouped data. So we have this problem here. Given the data set 48645391, and 8, find the first, second, and third quartiles. Um, in our solution to this problem, we are going to arrange the numbers in ascending order. So the smallest number there is 0, then we have 1, we have two ones there, so you have 1, 1, and then the next number is 2, and 2 is appearing once. The next number is 3, 3 is also appearing once. We have 4, 4 is appearing twice, so we have 4, 4. The next is 5. 5 is also appearing twice. 5, 5. The next is uh, 6. 6 is appearing twice. 6, 6. 7. 7 appears once. 8. 8 is appearing twice. 8, 8. 9. 9 is also appearing twice. 9, 9. And then 10. 10 appears once. So we count to make sure that we have our numbers correct. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So it is complete. We're going to start with the second quartile. It is ideal we will start with the second quartile. It will be able to help you to divide the data set into two equal halves. Since we have 17 items, 17 divided by 2 is 8. So we are going to have only one number in the middle. So we get the first 8 on one side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Then we get the last 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we see now that we have this 5 in the middle. So it is also known as the median. So the second quartile, which is Q2, is equal to 5. Remember, it is also known as the median. So with this, we go with the first quartile this time around. The 5 has divided the data set into 2. The first 8, where we are going to get our first quartile, and the last 8, we get our third quartile. So the first quartile, known as Q1, we are going to divide the 8 items we have here into two equal parts. 8 divided by 2, 4. So we have the first 4 and the last 4, which means we are going to have two numbers in the middle. Since we have two unequal numbers in the middle, what we do is we are going to add the two numbers and then divide by 2. So 2 plus 3 gives 5. 5 divided by 2 gives 2.5. So 2.5 is the first quarter. So we then go for the third quarter, which is Q3. We're going to get our third quartile from the last eight. So we also divide the eight numbers into two. So we have the first four and the last four. Again, we are going to have these two numbers in the middle. Since we have the two numbers in the middle the same and equal, so we're going to just have our third quartile to be eight. And that's all for the solution of this problem. And this is where we are ending this tutorial. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and share this video. Also remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until we come your way again, goodbye.